Hello, welcome to Encouraging Word. Uh, we're going to be in Hebrews chapter 12. Uh, we'll go ahead and pray. Lord, thank you for this day, this uh, beautiful day. Um, thank you for your for your spirit, Lord, and that you are with us to guide us and help us and carry us through. Um, be with all those that need your healing touch, Lord, and uh, touch their touch their lives, heal their bodies, and give their family peace and 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 just be with them, Lord, and uh, be with all those who have lost loved ones recently. Thank you, Lord, for all you do for us. In your name, amen. So, Hebrews 12, 2. Upside down will not work. There we go. Looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross, despising the shame, and is set down at the right hand of the throne of God. Ah, uh, Jesus endured shame, in, endured the shame, the pain, and everything. And God is the the one who, He's the one who who it's His work and His work with the Holy Spirit and His work that gives us the ability to have faith. He's the uh, He's the one that that did all the work and uh, and took all the pain and the shame so that we can have a relationship with him he endured the cross endured the shame and it was and he had joy in all of it he took joy because he knew what would be the end he knew what what would be the end and it was it was it was a task set before him but he took it with he took it with he took it with joy we should all take. Uh, we should all remember what uh, what Christ did, and be and be joyful for all that He has done for us, and and remember that when trials and troubles hit our lives, that we should we should take joy that uh, that we have God with us, and that someday, uh, and that we will get through it all, and someday we will be with Him. So, take care. God bless, um, and uh, and everybody have a good night. See you. See you next time.